So you may have seen my next guest from his appearances on The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon or even back in the day with Jay Leno. Our favorite New Yorker is back in Denver this weekend performing at Comedy Works at the Landmark. And Bobby Collins joins me right now. Good morning, Bobby. Thanks for Good getting up morning, early with Amelia. us. Mill, you could make a train take a dirt road. Damn, girl. Say that to all the girls. <laughs> so what you been up to since your last, uh, you know, appearance here in Denver? You're living in New York? No, I live in California okay. and New York. Okay. I uh, I like New York better, California. Oh, how, look how beautiful. Look, look at my face. <laughs> uh, people are just nuts. New York, live quick, die quick, talk quick. I lost my keys, can't find my car, give me a gun. Come to Denver, don't. Dee -do, dee -do. It's nice here. Nice and chill Oh, here. God, this is God rubbing my shoulders. I always love coming back, love and it's it. just a pleasure. It really is to well, come back. happy to have you here. So I followed you on Instagram today, oh. and the first thing that I see is a post with you and your daughter, but you weren't actually physically in the photo. So tell us the story behind this post. This is a look at your Facebook page here. Last weekend, I was in Cleveland working, and she <laughs> was in New York, and she went out on a date. She went to a restaurant, and unbeknownst to her, the guy pointed out, is that your dad oh sitting gosh. in the picture behind? She freaked. And I, she called me. She goes, do you know? And she took that, had the guy take. I said, I'm always got an eye on you. Yeah. Because that's the one. That's the one that moved back in. Remember when they move back in, when they move out? You don't move back in. Oh, you were secretly happy about it. Oh, come, come on. on. My wife was on a chair with a rope. <laughs> Bobby, kick the chair. Kick the chair. I go, I can't. I got a gun in my mouth. <laughs> Are you out of your mind? That's the one that, ugh, I have three daughters. This is the one. I don't like her that much. Well, it shows that you're up where, somewhere in her conscience, right? Always yeah. over her shoulder. Watching because I'm always telling her what to, to do. Well, right. Oh, You're no, this there. is the one. All right, so you are performing at Comedy Works heading into this weekend, but you didn't get your start in comedy. You've opened up for people like Cher, Dolly Parton, Frank Sinatra. First of all, you're not old enough to have done any of that, so tell Listen me the details. to you. I got underwear older than you. <laughs> I think I'm wearing them. Gosh. No, I travel a lot. I do a lot. I, I <laughs> you know, I comment on the world. Remember, and you know, we're sharing the planet with a lot of different types of people. Yeah, now. we are. We got to start thinning out the herd. <laughs> you know, the gene pool could use some chlorine. More people like you, is that, is that what you're saying? No, just you gotta comment and let people know. You gotta, you know, things are LGBTQ. I don't bother anyone, I just wanna know where to pee. You know, I see women around the country pushing baby carriages. I look in, they're dogs. Are women giving birth to animals now? Oh and the kids gosh. are on leashes. We got a president that got impeached. I guess orange is the new black. <laughs> You gotta oh tell let I'm people have to be know. Careful with you. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> you gotta be careful though, because I am one of those dog moms. I don't have the stroller, but I do have the little guy who loves to come places. Is with that me. right? I'll bring him to your show. Oh. All right. So you talk a lot about New York in yep. your comedy set. So what uh, what makes New Yorkers so different than the rest of us? Um, <laughs> I grew up obvious. on the subways. <laughs> okay. I was just in Birmingham, Alabama. These people, they're not that high up on Brain Mountain. When you talk to him, you want to say to him, why don't you roll your head around so I can hear that marble going around and around. <laughs> it's, you know, and their big thing is, oh, hide behind religion. Bless your heart. In New York, that means go yourself. So it, it's all different. Matter of fact, Alabama, and it happened two weeks ago, it's the only place in America where I've been in my life where I actually said to another human being, hey, that, that's a nice tooth. <laughs> and and he thanked me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh. This is what's happening around the country. Yeah. You gotta you gotta talk about it. Hey, poke fun at it, right? Make everybody just like chill a little. I and got on the plane the day. other day, kid next to me, metal all over his face. Looked like he fell into a tackle box. Twelve rings going across his eyebrows. He's looking at me, I'm looking at him. I go, You ought to put a you ought to put a shower curtain up there. <laughs> this is what's going on. You gotta go talk about it. Oh my gosh. Well, we've got about 30 seconds left. I hear you have a take on New Year's resolutions. Have you broken yours yet? No, no. My Tell New Year's make is, people then. laugh, be informative, show both sides of things, let people decide for themselves. What goes around comes around. God first, family second, career third, put one ahead of the other. You always got to get back on where you got off. All right, Bobby, thank you so much, so much for joining us. You are a delight. It was a pleasure to meet you.
All right. Well, you can catch Funny Man Bobby Collins at Comedy Works South at the Landmark tonight and Saturday. That is 5345 Landmark Place in Greenwood Village. Showtimes are 715 and 945 p.m. Call 720-274-6800 for tickets or go online to ComedyWorks.com. You can also find Bobby's book on the inside, Witticisms and Wisdomisms at BobbyCollins.com.